In managing the red urchin fishery, there's a lot of variables to how the product is harvested, the amount. Dive fisheries are mainly reef diving. Quality is a big factor. Uh, weather will limit their efforts to get off on the reefs and fish and that can reduce quality, which reduces harvest rates, which reduces the amount of product being exported. So weather plays a big factor. Quality is what dominates how they fish. That's a yellow goo. Now there is cooperation among all the buyers and all the fleets. We have flexibility to move around. If one area of the quality is not so good at this time, we can leave it, go to another area where the quality is good for the market, and then you can go revisit the other area Hopefully later on in the year, the quality is going to be better there. And we work with fisheries all the time, so they know us and they trust us. Very good um, relationship. It's like gardening, you know, you're just taking them when they're ripe. You know, you're not just taking everything out. You're going in, taking the best ones and then leaving, coming back when it's time to pick them again. Eh? The only quality that we have is is uh, to carefully put them in the fish hole so that they don't break up and uh, keep the, the reefers on so that they're nice and cool. Bring them into town uh, in good shape. They're still alive and kicking. I usually uh, go for a truckload, which a truckload is about uh, 50,000 pounds. And uh, once I get a truckload, I have to leave. I can only stay there for two days. So if I get 20,000 or 30,000 I have to go in because it's a two-day limit of staying out there. When they come into town, they're still fairly fresh. So from the diver who's picking it at the bottom of the ocean to the connoisseur who's eating it in New York, all along the way the product is fully traceable and it goes through federal registered plants that are managed and regulated by the Canadian Food Inspection Agency and they issue health certificates for each load based on where it's been harvested, what boat it's been harvested and what date it's been harvested. So all along the way the product is fully traceable. It's world-class food safety. Our processors are really great. They're super experienced Processing uni and making it the right product takes a lot of special techniques. A lot of our guys have been trained in Japan. The packing of sea urchins is like an art form because especially with the Japanese, they always say the Japanese eat with their eyes. So everything has to be laid out just perfectly. All the colors of the urchins match. It's really important what the processors do and of course their marketing efforts are what really brings value to our fishery as the products exported overseas.